I'm here to give you a little update about Connor's uh, cross-country recovery ride. Um, really exciting. He just crossed into California yesterday. Um, so that puts him a little under 4,000 miles into his trip. It's been 73 days he's been on his bike. Connor is scheduled to end his trip uh, Tuesday, November 17th. His plan is to jump right uh, into the Pacific Ocean off of the Santa Monica Pier. Uh, so that'll be a really nice way to kind of top off this super remarkable adventure he's been on. One of the biggest uh, things for him um, has been how much his journey uh, and the uncomfortable nature of the journey has, has reminded him of the some of the feelings of how he felt in his early recovery with the uncertainty of where he's going to sleep night to night um, the weather fluctuation from you know when he was in Arizona it was you know it, it got into the 70s and then at night it would dip into the 30s good morning late morning woke up to the snow feeling good ready to go he's had to adapt and I think so much of, of early recovery and that journey is about adapting and Connor should be back on the East Coast back on Cape Cod um, by the end of next week uh, and November 18th I think 19th uh, and we're planning a way to celebrate his uh, trip with well strong and um, other people in the recovery community back on the East Coast. So um, be on the lookout, we'll have some event probably in the beginning of December for that.